was watching this Conan O'Brien live stream. Uh, Conan does this thing where he takes his show all over the world and does, you know, crazy uh, cultural experiences. Israel, Haiti, right now he's in, in Italy. And uh, I was watching, watching them uh, stream live on, it must have been Facebook, uh, where Conan is just, he's in, this, um, he's in this glove store and he's, you know, talking to the clerk there and, and buying gloves. Uh, well, this group of uh, tourists come up to him and without speaking any English, you know, just motion like, hey, can, can we take a selfie with you? So he says, sure, sure, sure. And they're standing next to him, taking a selfie. And then the next few, and then it just keeps going and going. And it's unclear whether or not um, the group knows who he is, but because one person is taking a selfie, all everyone else is like, oh, I, sh I should get a selfie as well. And this reminds me of last summer. We went to a little town called Frankenmuth, which is like this, you know, old world arts and craftsy, uh, I want to say Amish, I know that's not right, but it's an Amishy kind of place. And uh, we were in a hotel, my, my family and I, we were in a hotel, and we needed something from the lobby, so I walked down to the lobby to, I think, maybe get an extra door key or something like that. And um, this tour bus pulled up. It was hundreds of tourists who were piling into the hotel and, you know, starting a trip. Well, as I was walking to the, to the front desk, one of the girls, um, I think they were from Korea, this, you know, this big group, grabs me and says, oh, oh, and holds up her phone, the kind of like how I saw them doing to, um, to Conan in this uh, video that I was watching, um, and wanted to take a selfie with me. And I'm not sure if she thought I was someone famous. I'm not sure why anyone famous would be in Frankenmuth. But um, I just eh, said, uh, okay, and I, and I took a selfie with her. And then the other people around her also wanted to take selfies with me. And you know, my family was waiting upstairs, and you know, I needed to get, get another key. Uh, so I just waved and then kept walking. But... It was such a surreal experience, and I, I wonder if there's like some picture of me with a random gal back in her home country saying, oh, hey, I met Wilmer Valderrama or something like that, and then it's a picture of me, and their friend's like, no, it's, that's, not, that's not him, that's just some random dude. Um, or she just really wanted to take a picture with, you know, a random person at this Amishy place. Um, in the lobby of a hotel, a, a mid-level hotel at, at best. That's one of the most random things that's ever happened to me.